What's about to happen? Uh, we're about to test your, what are they called, side force generators? Side force generators, yeah, SFGs. Oh, you're like a fancy human now. This is on the, uh, what model is this? It's the extra 300. <laughs> on that one? Yep. Uh, this is actually, it, it flies quite well with dad's modifications with the uh, servos and stuff, but uh, this is our first, I guess, aero mod. Yes. Your first aero mod after watching Con. Yes, Con's, his... yeah, he's looked really good. But anyway, have fun. See how we go, let's not break it. I haven't trimmed it around either, just so you know. It has a little bit of just a right roll of gold. That's pretty good. That's just holding you all there. Yeah. Mm. Now let's try to trim it. Let's see how it feels. That's great. <laughs> Flies. That's pretty good. Is it okay? I'm happy with that, yeah. Because I forgot to trim it. There's a little bit of turbulence in the air today. Yeah. So it's not quite. On yeah, they're really laggy, these servos. That's mm -hmm. so kind of hard to have confidence with them. Uh, but your pitch servo feels all right. I think servo upgrades are definitely in order for this model. You like doing that? The stock really? servos were terrible on it. They're very, very sort of glitchy and steppy. These servos are much nicer, but they need to be quicker. Nice though. That was a bit off center, but that's fine. I'm a bit scared to hold it low just because of the Yeah, I know. And those the wind's picked up too, I can't believe this. Yeah, but she's still handling it like a champ. It's very turbulent there today. Yeah. It was nicer when I flew this morning with it. Well, those side force generators are seem, seem to be working well. Yeah, actually, let's do some uh, slow speed. She'll drop a wing slightly. As long as you don't put the power on too quickly, she just pulls out nice and smooth. That's pretty good, isn't it? There's not a ton of uh, pitch up, but also don't have a ton of rate. Actually, that's getting, getting there now that I'm getting confident. Yeah. Hard to tell. The altitude management is actually pretty good. I wanted to drop a wing there when I had it roll for your. Sorry, I'm like 2Ks up. You're not actually 2Ks up at all. That's not bad. That's pretty good. Yeah. I think um, you tried to scale these up by like 10% from what cons were, right? Yeah, you could probably look at more. That's what I recommend it. And yeah. I think it I think it feels good. I'm not, I don't know much about aerodynamics to be honest, but I know that air doesn't scale with the plane. So I figured that we probably still want by scale bit of vertical stability. Flies great though. She flies really nice. Got my sunnies on and a fly's trying to go between my sunnies and my eyeballs while I'm trying to film. I've got no idea what the wind's doing, by the way. So when you're landing, so good luck. Is it our landing time? Uh, we've got 30 seconds anyway. And that'll bring it down on storage. Okay, which is the wind's kind of crosswind. That's a yeah. good spot. I think the direction you're coming now might be into the wind. As in... Yeah. This way? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, it's more. No, it's tailwind now. Tailwind now. So you're leaning the other direction, but it's gonna be. Look, it doesn't matter. Just do what you want. If you're comfortable getting it down with a slight tailwind. One thing that's nice about these because they can do like high offer and that you can basically high offer. I think it's changed directions again on you, buddy. Oh, I thought it has too. <laughs> what the hell? I could just feel the wind. Oh, 
<laughs> on my face. That is hilarious. That pass was hands off the six, by the way. Was it? I went oh. up to uh, she was flying. That's uh, pretty impressive. She's tracking really nice with these. Yeah, it actually it's it's completely transformed the airplane, in my opinion. Anyway, yeah. you definitely need better servos though, and oh, especially 100%. in hundred percent. It's kind of crosswind again, but that's fine. Perfect. There we go. Yeah, happy days. That's good. That was a really nice upgrade. It actually is a very noticeable difference, uh, especially just in tracking. Uh, it's definitely easier to do knife edge pass. High offering. I never did high offers with it before, so I don't know yeah. if that's. But I presume no, it's, it'd be it's much better in the high offers. Not. It's not. It's less likely to drop that wing. Yeah, and it seems like too when it is about to stall, it's a lot less violent. You've got a lot. I actually stole it and I tried it out and it just <laughs> barely dropped the wing. I mean, even if you were down low, you'd be able to recover from it easily. So it wasn't. Yeah, that's, pretty, that's a 3D print, eh? 3D print, yeah, there you go. So these are 3D printed. Um, they've got like a mount that glues into the wing. Um, and then they're just screwing with them three screws, I think it is. Yeah, so there's yeah. a bit of extra weight on the wings, too. And these are lightweight PLA, too, just to keep the weight down. But it doesn't seem to have impacted anything, has it? No, and they're quite stiff. I told you to make them stiff. Yes, very, very stiff. But yeah, I reckon put some nice servos in this, and I think it's going to be a beautiful model. And there we yeah. go, guys. Catch you later.